हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल टुडे आई विल बी डिस्कसिंग अबाउट द सिचुएशन वेयर द कंट्रोल फाइल इज मिस और बाय मिस्टेक इफ समवन डिलीटेड द कंट्रोल फाइल इन दैट सिचुएशन व्हाट वी नीड टू डू एज वी नो दिस कंट्रोल फाइल इज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट when we are talking about the starting of the database if the control file is not available then the database will not be starting so let me tell you something about what will happen when the control file is not available the first thing is database will not start when the database is up and running and at the same time if the control file is missing then currently running session will not happen per there will not be any problem when the database is up and running but next time when we shut down the database and will try to start the database again that time it will try to search the control file and if it is not available then the database will not go into the mount stage so in that case we need to restore the control file we can restore the control file from if you have already taken the arman backup or in control file we do have the option we called it as a multiplexing multiplexing it means to say when we are creating the database that time we will maintain the copy of control file in a different mount point because in if something went wrong and one of the mount point is not able to mount with the server then in that situation there should not be any issue on our database so that the another mount point where our control file is available that can be accessible with the database so i will demonstrate the same thing where our uh, one of the control file is missing and how we can recover the same control file by using the another control file let's me tell you in a practical way so i am connecting to the database okay so this is my database sorry uh, server i am connecting with the test db database okay let me connect with the sql plus okay then we will check whether we do have a different different we do have the copies of control file show parameter control underscore files okay so here what i'm seeing there are two control files the first one is a control 01 second one is a control 02 as this is my test environment i am i have put both the control file in a same data disk group but if you are going to the production you will find one of the control file is available in data disk group or maybe another one is available in fra like that you will see so just to create this just to stimulate this problem what we will do we, we will delete one of the control file okay so this is my second session this is the same session i am just uh, login with the grid user because this uh, this group is owned by grid user i am connecting with the asm cmd Okay first we need to say the environment okay 
que es un CMD ls my control file is available in data ls then it is in test db here here i can see there are two control files control 0 1 control 0 2 now i will try to remove this second one but the thing is it will not allow me to remove the control 0 2 control file second because the database is up and running not all operation perform alteration perform because it is currently being used by our database so in that case first we need to shut down the database see my database was up and running so this database was using the control file now i am shutting down the database so that there will not be any lock on between database and the control file okay so now database is shutting down okay now our database is shut down now okay now i am removing this control 02 if na in this situation if i am trying to open my database first it will go to the no mod stage where it will use the p file then it will try to find out the control file but we have already deleted the second control file so we are getting the error as error in identify the control file if i am checking the log file let's see show parameter dump will show you display you about the con uh, location of alert log file we have one file as alert okay so here if i'm going to the bottom there you can see one error as control 02.ctl does not exist in the directory test db because we have already deleted the second control file in this situation what we can do we have the copy as control 01.ctl because when we are talking about the multiplexing both the control file having the same information to copy this we have cp command and then we need to use 02.ctl okay see here it is now copying 01 to the 02 if i'm checking now we have both the control files available under data disk group okay now i will try to connect with the sql plus our database is in mount stage so i will shut down the database and then i will try to start the database first it will search for the p file it is available then it will go for the control file location we have already copied the control file with the name control 0 balance control 0 2 over there so there should not be any issue while getting the control file and the last one is we will open the database okay the database is mounted because database found the control file available as per the p file or sp file and now database is up and running so this is the way when we have a multiplexing available and one of our control file is missing if you have any queries you can write mail to me or you can also write in the comment box i will try to resolve your issue and for training purpose you can get the details on email or you can directly reach out to me by cell number okay thank you so much bye bye please subscribe like my channel see you again with the next video